I think this might be an easier way to do it. So say I have my PowerPoint and this slide right here is selected. I go play from current slide. Now if I bring my cursor over here, I get, I want to click here so my cursor is hidden. Then with the Mac, I'm going to hold down the shift key, the command key, and the number four key, press them all at once, and you see I have this little target. So this is to do a screenshot. So I can start in one corner, come down to the other, and I'll end up just, when I let go, it takes a picture of the screen. So let me get to iMovie. And so right here, it'll come out on your desktop on a Mac as a screenshot, and it's an image. So I can just drag the image down. And so this way, I now have control over it just as a single image like this. So it will come on, and you know, as we've discussed, I can adjust the duration of it. Also, what I discovered was that when I showed you that technique using the movie, that it was a low resolution version of the slides, where here, if we go full screen, the, the, the resolution is much better. So I think you have more control this way, and I think you can figure out the screenshot, and so I think this will be a better approach for you.